we're going to have good luck with our weather today. Okay. Rain's going to hold off in Omaha for most of the day. Take a look. It's been pouring a lot of the morning across western Platte and Polk counties. This is a cold front that's really not moving all that much. It will slowly drop south and east, but not until later tonight is when we're worried about Omaha, or rain here in the Omaha metro. But if you live in Stromsburg, Columbus, maybe David City and West Point is as far east as I want to say. Basically, this line from West Point to Stromsburg. If you live north and west of there, expect these on and off showers and storms all day because that front is not going to be moving all that much. And you can see more rain moving in across those areas early this morning. They're also under a flash flood watch in Madison and Stanton County, so that rain could pile up pretty quickly through tomorrow morning. Clouds streaming in across the Omaha metro for now, but they'll start to thin out as we go through the remainder of the morning. There's an upper level disturbance across the Dakotas that'll finally push this far enough south and east that we start to see the rain later tonight. But then it takes up residence. This front is going to be right along Interstate 80. Still some uh, disagreement in the computer models as far as exactly where it sets up, but that'll make, uh, that'll make a big difference as far as our temperatures go heading into early parts next week. Bet on rain. And a big drop in temperatures. And then to our northwest, a huge trough digging in and much cooler air, seasonally cool air across parts of the Pacific Northwest, the Intermountain West, low 50s in Great Falls, Montana. I would take that. Lots of 70s, lots of 80s across the eastern United States, lots of warm temperatures just for one more day here in Omaha. Right now, you're waking up to 71 degrees at Epley, a dew point of 65. Winds out of the south southeast at 10 to 15 miles an hour. 68, Red Oak, Harlan, Maryville, 69, Plattsmouth, and Nebraska City, low 70s as you get deeper into eastern Nebraska. So there's that cold front still to our northwest by noon. A little area of low pressure is going to start to ride along that front, produce more showers and storms late today. And then late this evening, you see that front starts to get a little bit closer to the Omaha metro area. Showers and thunderstorms fire up overnight. We could see some periods of heavier rainfall here in Omaha late tonight, but then more rain as we go through Monday. There are the scattered thunderstorms. Maybe a little break tomorrow evening, but waiting in the wings, this area of low pressure is going to wind up pretty quickly. Storms moving in Monday night, and then really on Tuesday as this winds up, lots of heavy rain possible late Tuesday afternoon into the overnight hours, possibly some severe weather with that as well. Now, the trend with the rain has always been heavier rain off to the north. I think northeastern Nebraska and northwest Iowa could see anywhere between two and four inches of rain locally through Wednesday. Here in Omaha right now, on the conservative side, I'd say about one to two inches as we go through the next several days. Not all coming at once. 76 at 9 o'clock, 85 at noon, a breezy day, 90 for a high temperature this afternoon. Down to 80 tomorrow, 77 on Tuesday, and even cooler and probably drying out a little bit on Wednesday with highs in the mid 70s, overnight lows in the mid to upper 50s Wednesday and Thursday, but summer, you know, not quite done. We're already back into the upper 80s by the end of this upcoming oh. week, but a couple days with highs in the 70s. Yeah. And August, I will take it. Open up those windows. Oh, I do that now. Yeah, I'm, oh yeah, I stepped Shocking. out. Yeah, I know. I'm getting older, I guess. Set Wiser. that timer. Really, Wednesday, you can yeah. shut off the air conditioning. All right, I like it.